Riddle, I bet you don't know who I am, do you? Wow, you were able to guess so far. You're right, I am an ant, but I'll bet you don't know exactly what kind of ant I am. I'm a green tree ant, as are all those ants. We are one big, busy family. We mainly live in the forests of Australia, but we also live in other parts of the world. Other types of ants live in these woods as well. Take, for example, our neighbours, the bulldog ants, who live underground. Bulldog ants are very dangerous to us, as they are very strong. Sadly, sometimes we have to fight them. Though they are much bigger than us, we are smarter than they are. We have many proven ways to protect ourselves from the strong enemy. Ants are at their best working above ground altogether. We create huge communities. My family, the green tree ants, make our nests in the trees and construct the nest with leaves. Each individual ant has a specific job during the construction process. We naturally help each other. Since the leaves used for the nest building are much bigger than we are, we must work together to manipulate them. Look how organised we are. Everyone knows what to do. I've heard that humans build their nests as well. You help each other and create great structures. We build our nests so our queen can go inside and lay her eggs. When the eggs hatch, an ant larva emerges. But before it will pupate, it produces silk, which we will use to connect the leaves. The silk is used to hold our nest together. From pupas, new ants, just like me, are fully formed. I hatched a few days ago in this beautiful forest. Are you surprised that I know everything already? That's because we are born knowing everything we need to know as ants. We don't have to learn a thing. Watch out! Watch out! There's an intruder! He's hungry and wants to eat us. Hurry, hurry! We must stop him. It's a trapdoor ant! He's got huge jaws or mandibles. Everyone at the alert! Now watch how we scare him off. When we feel threatened by an enemy, we have poison in our bodies which we spray on them. That's it! We won! Oh gosh! Now it looks like the bulldog ants want to attack us. Well, they do live really close to us. Hope they won't bother anyone. We'll have to prepare for another fight. These ants 
have very good eyesight. The rest of us don't see that well. That's because we don't really need to. In order to communicate and maintain orientation, we use scent traces from our bodies. When we find something to eat, we'll mark the path by leaving the scent. Other kinds of ants use different ways of communicating, such as stridulation or tasting. In our communities, our queen is the most important ant in the nest. She lays the eggs from which male ants and worker ants will come. The job of the workers is to care for our nest. They build and protect the nest against enemies. The male ants are in charge of reproduction. The workers care for our eggs and for the hatched larva, like this bulldog ant. See? While our new nest is being built, we must be very careful that no one attacks our queen. We are very vulnerable when we are not all together. Looks like our neighbours got some secret news. I bet they are planning to do something bad to us. They saw us build a new nest and I think they want to find out if there might be something good inside that they can eat. From the moment we finished building our nest, someone tried to sneak into our pantry. I'd better go and warn the others before it's too late. Oh gosh, another trespasser! It's a Jack Jumper Ant! Attention everyone! The invaders are coming from the other side! They have very dangerous poison, so we'll have to outsmart them! Bulldog ants are paying close attention to the situation. All green tree ants gather here. The battle has now begun. Don't worry, by working together, we're sure to beat them. The transmission of signals is a very important part of winning the battle. It's over, the enemy had to retreat. Let's enjoy a bit of peace for a while. After what they saw, I would think the bulldog ants wouldn't want to attack us anymore. I hope it'll last a good while so we can concentrate on our work. Did you notice how skilled and flexible the ants are? Ants can be compared to the work of an artist. Or even a pilot. Ants are incredibly strong. We ants can carry many times our own body weight. Most humans can't do that. Just imagine, would you be able to lift someone bigger than you over your head? Would you be able to lift a few people at the same time like that? Ants are able to actually combine our individual strengths together. In order to build a complex structure, 
such as our nest. Ants are built for working long and hard. We do whatever is good for us all. When I collect food, it's always intended for everyone, not just for me. No one does anything just for himself. We don't do anything just for fun either. All of our time is spent caring for our nest. We also build many paths that lead into our nest. The ants that live in dry regions are able to carry drops of water to their anthill. I love being an amazing ant. All of us are very proud of our anthill. Hmm, it seems that the bulldog ants won't try anything against us today. They're probably scared of our great combat tactics. I don't blame them, we're really good. When the fighting has stopped and the woods are peaceful, we can start to move some tasty food into the pantry of our new nest. Here it is. Look what we have found. Why are you making faces? We love it, it's so delicious. We just had different tastes from you. Take a good last look at us working together. Together, we create something no single ant would ever be able to create. And now it's time to bid you farewell. Goodbye, and don't forget your friends, the ants. <laughs>